A cover letter now captured the nation, considered to be one of the best by a firm on Wall Street. And it all started from a student who went right here to Placer High in Auburn. Looks like the key to his viral letter was his honesty. You know, he broke through the clutter. You know, we get a lot of interest. In, in a relatively limited number of positions. A cover letter written by San Diego State Finance student Matthew Ross to investment banking firm Duff and Phelps had just the right mix of confidence and candidness. Matthew wrote, I won't waste your time inflating my credentials, throwing around exaggerated job titles or feeding you a line of crap about how my past experiences and skill set align perfectly for an investment banking internship. What do you think about his honesty? Well, I think uh, that's the kind of people we have here at Auburn, you know. From small town roots to a big burst in fame, networks now wanting to hear from the kid who wrote what could be the world's most famous cover letter. It says here he may not think he has unbelievably special skills or genius eccentricities, but it looks like he still has a lot to brag about. When he was here at Placer High, for example, he played basketball, baseball, and football, taking his teams to championships as a star athlete. So far, Matt's choosing to stay out of the spotlight. All he meant to do was get a summer and internship, where he says he has no qualms about fetching coffee, shining shoes, or picking up laundry, and will work for next to nothing. What do you think is the key to writing a good cover letter? Uh, sell yourself. What matters is if you make a name for yourself. His willingness to work, making him a prized commodity. A lot of influential firms in Wall Street saw that letter, and most of the feedback was, was very positive. And hey, that's a tough audience. And if he's looking to come back home, well, Liberty Tax and Auburn may want to bring him in for an interview. I hire a lot of people who don't have an experience, and we're willing to train and work with them. So do you think you might hire him? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Certainly. So Matt, we got you a job. Yeah. Send it here. <laughs> From Auburn to San Diego State and off to New York City, it looks like Matthew is going places. And it may not be about whether he gets hired or not, but more like where he chooses to go.